the one that is more tight. You can anchor the leg. You can use your forearm. And again, you can go on the inner side of the leg where you will be kind of on the edge of one of your semi muscles and the adductor magnus, which sometimes these two muscles can get stuck together. So again, you kind of go slow. As you can see, you're not putting too much pressure because when you go slow, you're already putting plenty of pressure on that area. Again, if so you can just either pause, do a little bit of wiggling, shaking, vibrating, just to kind of help the muscles to relax. You can make more pressure, less pressure. You can adjust whatever you need. And again, my hand and my arm are going to follow the border of the sheet. So I'm not aiming for the inner side because we are working on hamstrings. So I'm kind of going to aim it a little bit more outwards and follow the sheet into the ischial tuberosity. You can do this. You can do this move one time. You can do it three times. If you want, you can even do the whole move coming all the way from the calf, going across, gentle with the back of the knee and into the hamstrings. Of course, you can do this with whatever speed you want. So you have this kind of options. You can even do this. If this is uncomfortable for you, you can anchor it and use just your hand. So it's the same technique. It's just that you're not bent over so much. So you can do this, do the same kind of technique, feeling for the tightness of the muscles, so we're shaking all the way. You can feel it right here in the middle of the hamstring so I can pause, wait, and then finish the movement all the way to the issue of the porosity.